Good morning, guys. How y'all doing? Um, today's gonna be a pretty cool day. Right now, I'm here at the shop waiting for my manager. Um, long story short, I'm gonna drive his service truck. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, take a condenser. Uh, what is it? Aluminum condenser coil. Uh, to a job site, we're gonna go ahead and install it because I guess the old one is leaking. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and take that coil, drive his truck. It's in Salina, so it's probably about two and a half hours from here. Yeah, about two and a half hours from here. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna go help the help the older guy out, help him install it, and then uh, just drive back. And that should be it. That should be all, all I'm doing today. I'm pretty excited. Basically, just gonna be all driving today. I feel like a new guy. Anytime you start a, when you're fresh, you're basically just running parts or whatnot. And that's how I feel today. There he is. And we were supposed to be here at 5 a.m. It's 5.13. Here's the condenser. Damn. What happened? You think it's gonna work? Yeah, Alright guys, so I got the coil on the back strapped up already. Um, driving 55 miles per hour, of course. So it'll probably take me like two something hours just to get there. Uh, the crane gets there about 8 a.m. So I should be I should be getting there around 7.30. 30 ish or so uh but no yeah almost eight so i just have to make sure i drive slow because i don't want this thing popping out and then i'm fucked but uh no we should be good so yeah uh two hour drive to the job site how about the uh the, the old timer guy and uh we should be good all right stop at the gas station and make sure everything's good Alright, we're good. There it is, guys. So today I'm the company's mule, you can say. But first, let me get something to eat because I didn't take bread. I didn't eat breakfast. Like This thing's, this thing's probably a solid eight out of ten. Smells really good.
All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and head over. Okay. What I'm gonna go ahead and do right now is uh, go get filter dryer, a jug of 410, solder, and that should be it. All right, guys, so I'm away to RSD and Selena's. I actually never been to this RSD before. Um, so, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and pick up a filter dryer, uh, 410A, solder, and what else? What else did he say? Shit, I have to call him. Uh, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and pick him up while he's brazing that coil. And uh, yeah, the reason I'm not recording a lot, guys, is because he's an old timer. So he doesn't like being in front of cameras, uh, things like that. Uh, he doesn't mind if uh, I'm recording the work. He doesn't care about that. He's super cool. But he just doesn't want to be his face on the camera because, I don't know, it's just maybe an old-timer thing. I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, he's pretty cool. He's been here for 30-something years. He's about to retire, like, in, I think he said three years, three, four years. So he's just, he's done. He's 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 done his time. Um, so, like I said, just pulled up to RSD. I'm going to pick up the stuff that I need. And uh, head back. I don't think it fits in the bag. Let's put it right here. So this is what happens when you forget your prescription sunglasses. Jesus Christ. It'll do for now. Once I get to the job site, I'll just take this one's off. Back and going. Looking nice. So now we just gotta go up in there, zip tie all the electrical, pull the vacuum on the other side, um, wired up the main power. That should be it. Charge it up. Like I said, guys, he's an old timer. He doesn't believe on mic on mic on gauge. He just pulls, uh, puts nitrogen on the system. Let it sit for 30 minutes. The state. He just pulls the vacuum and calls it good. Because I know a lot of old timers don't like using the mic on gauge. So. It's cool. It's cool. Yeah. Guys, what I like to do anytime I'm working with an older guy, uh, a lot of times they like to do everything by themselves. So instead of just looking, I like to go around, start cleaning everything up, uh, go get things that he needs. It makes everything easier. about to go ahead. 
that and charge them up. Alright guys, here's the end product. Put everything back in, nice. Picked up all the trash. Damn. I just had a cup of trouble real quick. Uh, I just want to talk about, I know I seen some comments saying, oh, that's why you left your other job because you start early and things like that. But the difference is, is I start early and now I get to go home early. So right now it's 12 o'clock and I'm already going home. So with a two hour drive, that's gonna be, what is it, nine hours already? Nine or so hours? So yeah, I thought I'd mention that. There's a big difference. If you wake up early, you get to go home early. So, it's, it's I love it, to be honest with you guys. Also guys, in my other company, um, I would wake up early, say 2 in the morning, 3, whatever. Um, and I'd still be getting home at 8, 9 at night time. Over here, wake up early, be home by 2 or 1. Right, before we head back, let me just make sure everything's still tight. of you guys have been doing this for a while also realize that our job a lot of times is not fit it's not as physical i mean it is but uh i feel it's more mental and i think that's worse because when it's physical you're able to go home sleep for an hour wake up and feel like new but when you're physically i mean mentally tired it takes you it takes you a while for your body to rest your mind to rest it's it's a whole different it's a whole different game so just to let you guys know that's the difference with this company here it's just sometimes physical but the mental it it's super 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 nice I'm, i don't get home super tired and, and i feel i feel great you know so that is the difference between waking up early on this company and mother company So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Pulling up to my house. Um, it wasn't a service call video, nothing like that. It was more of a vlog. I actually enjoyed doing this one a little bit more. So, like I said, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, until until next time.